Okay, before we go on, the next thing is a recap of the probability. Find the probability of rolling up number four on a six-sided dice. So if I'm rolling a dice, I want to write these numbers out. Okay, there's only one event. I only roll once, so only one ratio. There's six numbers, and there's one four. So I simply take one divided by six times 100, and that's going to be 16.7. Okay, find the probability of drawing three straight clubs from a deck of cards. You're going to replace the cards you draw. So I have my card sheet here. I'm kind of a, I'm a unerase this stuff. Okay. That's a jack. That's a two. Okay. All right, so there's three events. Now it says I'm replacing the cards I draw, so there's always 52 in the deck. And we want to draw clubs. Well, here's the clubs, 13. But I'm replacing what I draw, so it's always 13. It does not go 13, 12, 11 if you're replacing it. So 13, go to the third power if you want. So 2197. And then 52 to the third. It, 52 to the third is 140,608. So divide times 100. Okay, 1.6%. Okay, find the probability of drawing three straight face cards from a deck of cards. You're not replacing the cards you draw. So now if I'm not replacing it, it goes from 52 to 51 to 50. Now I want face cards. There's three events. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so I draw one, but now, now there would only be 11. Okay, let's say I draw that one. Now there's only 10, so when I'm not replacing, I've got to pretend they're not there once I draw. Okay, so 12 times 11 times 10 is 1320. And 52 times 51 times 50 is 132,600. So I divide times 100. 20 divided by 132,600. Okay, that's going to be, uh, well, that goes up to 1%. Okay. Okay, I find the probability of rolling heads on back to back flips of a coin. Now, a coin has heads, it has tails. So we're doing back to back means there's two events, there's two possibilities, but there's only one heads. Okay. So that's 1, and that's 4. I would hope most of you know the percent for that. It's 25. Okay, I find the probability of drawing an ace from a deck of cards. This time there's only one event. 52. 1, 2, 3, 4 aces. Okay, I jumble the problems up on this packet. 4 divided by 52 times 100. 7.7%. Find the probability of drawing a face card, then drawing a jack if you replace the card you picked first. Okay? So, there's two events. So, I am replacing it. So, 52 and 52. So, face card. Okay? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Now I'm replacing the face card, so I don't need to worry about crossing anything out. And then I want to draw a jack. So there's 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so that's 48 over 2,704. Okay, so 1.8%. Okay, find the probability of drawing a face card, then drawing a jack. If you don't, re actually this problem can't be done because you won't know if that face card is a jack because you don't know what to cross out. Okay, so I would say on that, and 